so. Diesel fuel is a liquid fuel that is made from the byproduct of petroleum. Diesel fuel was originally supposed to be coal dust, but in 1895, Rudolf Diesel discovered the use of petroleum products for liquid fuel in diesel engines. Commonly known examples of diesel engines would be school buses, construction machines, public buses, trucks, trains, boats, military vehicles, and even generators. Over 94% of freight relies on diesel, and they are also known for their fuel efficiency and reliability. How does chemistry play a role in making diesel? Chemistry plays a big role in making diesel fuel. First of all, once the crude oil is extracted from the earth, it is placed in a distillation tower. The oil is then heated up to over 400 degrees Celsius. This begins a process known as separation that separates different components that have different boiling temperatures. As you go up the distillation tower, the boiling temperature is cooler and the refining process is more tedious, creating kerosene, gasoline, butane, and propane after diesel fuel. Chemists need to know the chemical composition of each mixture that is being separated at each boiling point. They need to know where to put the distillation plates in the tower to collect each compound effectively and efficiently. After the diesel fuel is collected at the distillation plates, it is then piped to a storage tank and ready to be shipped off to be used by the consumers. Thanks for watching. Check out chemistryislife.com for more info on this and hundreds of other subjects.